Leadership. Community service. Aerospace and STEM. Emergency services. Wingmanship. This is the Captain Bud Jackson Composite Squadron. Good evening. I'm Cadet Staff Sergeant Tanusha Shok, and this is my video for the CAP Summer Video Challenge, and my video is on the basics of flight. So flight has four main flight mechanics. There's lift, thrust, drag, and weight slash gravity. So lift is the upward force, thrust is the forward force, drag is the resisting force, and weight and gravity are the downward for force. And I wrote drag as the resisting force because technically it doesn't pull the airplane backwards, it's just resisting the airplane from moving forward. So what is lift? Lift is generated by an aircraft's wings, and lift is basically the ability of the aircraft to go upward. So the way an aircraft is able to generate lift is through the shape of the wing. So the wing is in the shape of an airfoil, as you could see in the image, the white is the airfoil. And when air travels, uh, it travels above and below the airfoil. And the shape of the airfoil forces the air that travels above the wing to move a lot faster. And faster air has less pressure, and slower air has higher pressure. So um, the slower and higher pressure air that it goes below the airfoil pushes the airfoil upwards, and it generates lift, pushing the wing upwards, and thus the whole aircraft. So next is thrust, and thrust is created by the airplane engine. And to the right, you could see a classic jet engine. And Airplane engines work by intaking and compressing air uh, using their fast propellers. And then they combine that air with uh, a fuel mixture inside the uh, plane. And this fuel mixture, air fuel mixture gets ignited and the ignition creates a chemical reaction and the energy from the chemical reaction propels the plane forward. So next up we have the two negative forces which are drag and gravity. So drag is literally any type of resistance that's caused by friction. So it could be air resistance, which is the most common form of drag. But even when a plane is trying to take off, the friction created by the ground is also drag. And gravity is also a negative force. And gravity is just the constant force that's always pulling us down. And the heavier the object, the greater the force of gravity. So that means that airplanes have to battle against a really strong force of gravity. These are my sources. Thank you.